Hello my beautiful simmers and welcome back to another speed build Welcome back guys to my channel I hope you had an amazing day So this is the last build that I'm going to show you in this a cozy fall save file that I'm doing with my dear and fellow simmer create for sims and um, this is the only lot that it's left for me to um, actually build so the whole save file it's a little bit more traditional style um, so I ended up with something a little bit more than why because oh my god uh, you have a lot of different you know styles and um it's more like suburban ish type of the world uh i really want i don't want to call it suburban but it's more like a traditional build so we really need something modern and alexandra already did uh, the lot next to this one and uh I, we really didn't know what to do with this bigger one this is 50 by 40 i believe and like only two lots on on one side of the world and i was like oh my god what i'm going to do i don't know how to start this and um i first made some kind of um i don't know terrain tool platforms you know uh figuring out what i'm going to actually build and how to use the, the like the whole space on this lot and i really didn't want it ma to make something extremely extremely huge but also i really wanted to uh make something very interesting and um you were about to see i skipped one part i literally skipped one part because i totally forgot when i start this i was so excited and um I, like ideas was coming through i didn't know uh where to start to do so i basically totally forgot to uh record one part you can see already that i did like the whole um exterior of the house um the fountains everything and then i just like oh my god i i, I don't know what i did so i needed to record at least something and um, i found the windows the windows are basically i believe a base game once yeah um i use a lot of base game um items on this lot so um the exterior it's very interesting i decided to go with um a very minimalistic approach and use uh very like a uh, black and white and uh, grays and uh, a little bit of like a wood i uh, freaking love this house like in a thousand years i could never i don't know pull something like this uh, uh it's because these kind of builds for me it's the builds that i'm always doing with the custom content but now uh you have one without the custom content which is crazy um i don't know i really 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 do love how this is uh, house looks like at the end you're about to see like every single corner of this house i really wanted to go with something extremely modern so minimalistic and you also have a lot of space to add something for the gameplay that you will probably need so basically i i gave you um i don't want to say empty canvas it's not empty at all but you know uh a start uh, to go with from this point and make something that uh, suits your needs so basically we already inside um, no matter how much this house looks extremely small from the outside like when you're watching like the whole exterior is bigger than than the actual house but inside you have so much space and looks so freaking interesting and modern i love the layout of this house i have really paid attention to the layout because if you have a huge house and a very big family um basically you need um you know you need to think well about the layout so we also have one bedroom that you're watching right now of course you have one bedroom downstairs um just because you can use this as a guest house you can use this as a main bedroom or 
also if you have uh, babies infants toddlers it's better to use uh, bedroom over here rather than upstairs because you know how this game performs and um, you actually when you have small kids you you will probably want it to have a bedroom downstairs because it's it's easier when you are playing so yeah and laundry of course and two bathrooms downstairs oh my god a very very spacious kitchen um i really do love this uh, before i start uh placing the items here in in, in this house in this like um, interior um, i decided to use a little bit of tool mod and make this custom oh my god what is this like um glass windows they're not glass windows or doors they are just like uh, dividers yeah but this is those clear clear i believe um small glass roof pieces oh my god i cannot talk today uh, that i often use for the for the roof uh, but I love sometimes use them since I am not using custom content. I love using them uh, for uh, things like this, especially for the showers. But for the showers, I decided to use something else uh, in this house because if you have a lot of these uh, small pieces, individual like uh, pieces uh, made with a tool mod, this could be very buggy and glitchy. Call it whatever you like. Yeah, and that's the reason why I only decided to use these uh, small pieces downstairs and uh, didn't want to use them a lot, but still, yeah. Uh, looks so much better because we don't have the arches, at least proper ones for this height, uh, for the, this wall height. And also, um, I believe they are more, uh, I don't know, the style is not fitting to this one because this is very modern so i decided to go with um a little bit different um approach and i i, I really hope you guys are going to enjoy this house as much as i uh enjoy building this i had so much fun with this house and just the fact that i'm not using a lot of items and a lot of clutter makes this so much easier to build and you know decor and um the finish i i only use a couple of items um just to you know add a small touch and something a little bit different um like i made like a custom candle uh and books especially here on this uh, coffee table um something that i didn't make oh my god for such a long time um i started also uh, you know when i started this channel i started um without using a custom content and i played a lot with the tool mod it was crazy but it was also a lot i have to admit um then i actually i uh, found out about the custom content that i want to use in the future so yeah uh now I'm only building no CC builds from time to time, especially in occasions like this when I'm doing a collapse or a save file with someone. And it is good somehow, um, sometimes to make a change because sometimes I get bored, not bored, but um, it's sometimes it's way too much building only with just the custom content or just w w without the custom content i don't know somehow i love to mix everything to have everything on my channel and when i feel that need to have some kind of a change i i love to do this from time to time and i was very very excited about this save file and also having a lot of fun because i'm doing this with my very good friend and also like i said uh, just the fact that i'm not using a custom content that i need to a little bit like uh, change my perspective and push my boundaries um it's always a good thing because when i come back when i uh, turn back to my regular content it's going to be a lot different and um probably i will have a more fun and more better ideas than i had before um like i'm making some kind of a um, small break but i'm not 
uh, looks like it. I don't know. I, I feel like uh, this is something that I really needed um, in my life in this time of in this period. So yeah, I, I really did enjoy, and uh, I feel so refreshed right now. I don't know what to say. Um, and so freaking proud of myself and Alexandra as well because I think we really did an amazing job um, I know that it's a lot more builds uh, to show you guys but we didn't record everything and also um, Alexandra decided to use a lot of her already builds that she already have uh, yeah, and uh, that really goes so well with this save file. So that's the reason why we are not showing you everything on our channel. So, so yeah, uh, finally upstairs, I already furnished like the main bedroom, and this is the only like kids slash teenage bedroom that you have. But still, if you need have a you know smaller kid, you can just you know switch the bed and we also have a one on the top of this house um, that I actually use for the gym and um, if you don't need a gym right now just you know change that room and use it for the like extra bedroom but I decided since I already have three bedrooms it's better um, uh, to add something some kind of activity uh, for this house and I decided to go with the gym because I think it's best the solution and this is the last bedroom like I said oh my, the last room and believe it or not I don't know what's going on but the items from the loft truck expansion pack are the items that I'm using all the time since they came up uh, I, I, I'm talking about the um, the gym equipment guys it's so freaking beautiful I love using them a lot um, maybe because they are new I don't know but somehow I think they look so freaking cool and good and that's the reason why I'm like using them a lot in, in every single build basically yeah I know I already built the gym maybe that's the reason why but I also really wanted to include the gym over here guys if you like this please give it a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell stay for the house tour also follow the Alexandra aka a uh, create for sim because she also have a youtube channel and also she's streaming on twitch don't forget to check that as well and see you guys next time love you all and bye bye everyone